Welcome back to my channel. This is the Guitar Viking L. You know, today I just want to talk about my channel. Uh, you know, this makes me wonder, you know, if I should continue this. I am not sure if people are, you know, um, enjoying my channel. I'm kind of struggling with uh, my channel's growth, um, channel's likes, um, channel's subscription. Um, those kind of stuff and uh, I'm just kind of uh, wondering what to do sometimes my motivation just goes so down and uh, I uh, I just don't know oh. hold on I think uh, somebody is here in the room I need to go and check out hold on for a second Look what I've got! So guys, this was in the box. Um, the guitar case of Ibanez Prestige. So let's open it up and see what's in it. Oh my God, this is an RBM. This changed everything. Now, I've got all the motivation I need to create videos for you guys. I gotta call Jeremy and show him that I got the RBM. Hey Jeremy. How's hey, it going? Yo, how are you? Good, good. Hey man, I gotta show you something. Oh yeah, well, what's going on? Check this out. What? Look at this. Where'd you, where'd you get that? <laughs> I can't tell you that. But oh, hey, my gosh. I got RBM. 400. Wow, that's beautiful. Oh man. So, let's talk about this. This is gonna be my main axe from now on. All it's, right. It's so cool. Awesome. Now I'm in the I'm in the RBM club. Welcome to the club. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Thank you so much, uh, Jeremy. All right, man. Um, so. <laughs> You know the back background story of this and why am I having this RBM 400 with me? So, um, can you please uh, explain about it? <laughs> oh, definitely. So, so this is really a, a really neat story. So, um, going way back in um, you know young Viking Al's day, um, whenever the RBMs were first. Um, you know, first out on the scene whenever they were first released from Ibanez and Reb Beach was touring the world with Winger. Um, you know, uh, a little bit younger Viking Al saw him and, you know, really wanted to have one, um, you know, back in the day. Um, so this is definitely kind of like a dream come true, you know, fulfilling, um, you know, pro prophecy, you know, coming to fruition. So this is awesome. Um, oh, I'm so yeah. happy for you, Al. Oh, <laughs> man. You know, um, it, this is such a beautiful guitar. It's uh, it's my dream. I always wanted to have uh, RBM, and I was always looking for uh, RBM. Of course, uh, with the Koa model, the the king of RBM, I always wanted that. Um, but uh, this time, um, Jeremy, you convinced me to um, to rescue the queen of RBM, which is the RBM 400. <laughs> 
yeah. Um, I wasn't uh, really interested um, in uh, rescuing this RBM when I saw it, but uh, well, you you um, you convinced me to um, rescue it, and here you go. I've got it <laughs> with me. Um, and actually, um, I uh, really want to thank you because. Uh, uh, without you uh, giving me, um, pushing my back and giving me courage um, to do it, uh, I wouldn't uh, do it. I, actually, I wasn't really interested at the beginning, but uh, looking at uh, it now, um, I'm glad I did it because, damn, this is, it's such a beautiful <laughs> guitar, man. Um, of course, the Koa uh, would be the best, but uh, still, it's such a beautiful mahogany. Um, and it, the condition is just amazing. This uh, previous owner um, had kept this in a really great condition in the guitar case of um, Ibanez Prestige guitar case for such a long time, and there's no scratch or you know it just it just looks brand new to me. Yeah, that guitar is basically like a time capsule. It's it's remained pretty much unplayed for almost 30 years. It's got a beautiful mahogany body. Um, it has the highly sought after Pau Ferro, you know, okay. Bolivian rosewood neck on it. Um, and it's actually had a couple of upgrades so far as pickups go um, to be, you know, even closer to the original sound of the uh, RBM2, um, you know, the, the, the top of the line Koa model. So, but uh, yeah, I mean, that is, that is just a phenomenal guitar, the RBM 400. Um, it's got, you know, just, you know, all the bells and whistles that the um, Koa model has, uh, just minus the Koa top. So I think you scored really nice on that guitar. Oh man, I'm so happy. Yeah, um, seems like the previous owner changed the pickup from the mm -hmm. Ibanez uh, original pickup to um, EMGs. Um, mm -hmm. And the, the, EMG system is a solderless system, so it's good if I want to change the the, the humbucker pickup, um, I can. Currently, it's uh, set to um, um, EMG 81, um, but I can easily swap it uh, myself uh, to EMG 85 or EMG 89 because it's a solderless uh, system, which is much easier to swap it and, and put it back easily. So, um, man. I'm so happy. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, I'm so happy for you. <laughs> I'm proud of you for making the decision to go for it too. It's a, you know, it's a big decision and it's, uh, I'm, it, I'm glad that it paid off <laughs> you know, for sure. Oh yeah. Yeah. So, so yeah, I don't know. Um, uh, you, you really, um, convinced me uh, and, uh, I'm really surprised that I, I, I've been, uh, convinced. <laughs> well, what, what is the, what's the magic? Well, basically, it's just, um, you know, the feel, the sound, um, you know, and the smell, as you can tell, um, of a natural, oh, you know, so good. a natural body guitar. It, uh, it actually has the you know, natural smell of the wood to it. Um, that Pau Ferro neck is something special, you know. Oh, yeah. Uh, it's just so smooth, easy to play, and it has that um, RBM profile that, you know, is a little bit smaller and narrower. Um, and it's just, it's super comfortable. So there's just something magical about that combination that he came up with, uh, you know, Red Beach back in, you know, the early '90s when he, you know, came up with the RBM um, and the neck profile and the combination of the woods and the pickups and everything. It's just, it's just really a killer guitar. Oh man, yeah, it's such a beautiful shape, beautiful guitar, made in Japan, um, well built. Mm -hmm. um, is this amazing? And the feeling of Pauferonet. Power neck, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, ah, wow, it is is amazing. I, yeah, know, it's hard to compare, isn't it? It's really <laughs> hard to compare. It, it looks great. It looks great. Um, it feels great. Um, and I'm just so happy. I'm just so happy. This is this is such a cool guitar. It sounds great too. Um, yeah. But uh, I'm so yeah. excited for you. I'm looking forward to all of the music and all the videos you're going to put out using that guitar since it's going to be your main axe now. Oh yeah, man. I need to play a lot. All right, um, Jeremy, thank you so much. I'm glad. Uh, I just want to show you that it arrived 
I'm so happy and uh, hey um, I gotta start uh, playing black magic with this so I'll talk to you later all right buddy all right See man. You later. congratulations okay thank you so much all right let's do this overdrive your life one right. two three overdrive, overdrive your, your life, life.